The purpose of this video is to show you some video quality for the Sony Handycam. This model number is HDR CX675. It's 9.2 megapixels. It is HD and it's a few years old, so it's not 4K. Camera has a HDMI out, micro SD card slot, telephoto and wide angle capabilities, detachable battery. It also has a headphone out and microphone in. It does have a cold shoe on the top. This is for holding an external microphone. Like a lot of handy cams, camcorders, has the flip out screen. And there you can access your menu settings and it's all touch screen. No more toggle switch as uh, cameras like this used to have. The camera does have three modes, movie, photo, and time-lapse capture. Movie and photo are pretty straightforward. Time-lapse capture, you, you might want to look at another video I just posted where it explains how to stitch together all your photos to create a time-lapse. The camera does not actually do that itself. Not this model, anyway. Other Sonys do. Not the one I'm using. We'll start with the photography mode. The colors look great. I've used it a few times. It's come in handy, but it's not necessarily built to use like a regular camera. As you can see here, Colors look good. Contrast looks good. Okay, going into the time lapse function. As I said earlier, it doesn't really create a time lapse video for you. It does capture sequential photographs like you're seeing here and then you can stitch them together yourself in a video editor. Of course, when you're buying a camera like this, the video is the most important part. So with that, I'm going to let these last few clips play out and try to include some indoor, outdoor, so you can see how it handles each situation.